Hi everybody, welcome back to Majestic Collectibles. Went to the storage unit yesterday and as you can see I pulled a, uh, a few boxes out. That's not all of them. Pulled 21 boxes total. I've got uh, three of them in the office so let's go in there and take a look. We, uh, we're supposed to get 5 to 10 inches of snow tomorrow so I thought if I'm going to be snowed in I might as well work. And there's, uh, there's two of the three there. Here's one up here. And uh, let's see what we got. Oh, good. The lid came off. I'm just happy about that right there. Star Trek. Another Counselor Troy. Very slow sellers. Oh, there's a Wolvie. So, it's not in his original costume, but they still sell okay. And I see some interesting stuff. I'm trying not to... Oh, Darkwing. Oh, one of my favorite Disney animated cartoons. Love Darkwing Duck. Annihilus. Villain. Let's see. Oh, there we go. There we go. Green Goblin. Always popular. Part of the Spider-Man history. Oh, another Wolvie. This box isn't very big, but it's doing all right. And a third Wolvie. Well, let's see what else we got in here. And a fourth Wolverine. Nice. Oh, what's this? Sunman. I'll make Sunman. And the Sun People. 19, let's see, 1989. I am not at all familiar with Sunman. Definitely kind of a Masters of the Universe themed, uh, I'm assuming, competitor. Huh. That's interesting. I'll have to do some checking. Some more bent cards. Oh! Turtles, anyway. Ray Filet. And, oh, let me see if get this out. Oh, there's a April. I think there might be another. Is that tracksuit April? There we go. Tracksuit April on those. Looks like it got a Star Trek. Yep, another Counselor Troy. And what are these here? These... Huh, I wonder if that's a send-off? I don't know. It's just got this little exclusive Batman and Superman figure off for details inside from April of 90. Seven, so let's open it up. Whoop. They can get it open one handed. Total Justice. And I gotta move this. Here we go. Okay, it's just an order form of some point, but it must be, let's see, there's Superman, Batman, or both. So that must have been a mail order. Mail order of some type. I'll have to do some research. There's still. Uh, Still sealed. Both of those are still sealed on that. Nice looking figures. I don't see any... Because it does have a part number. I'll look it up by part number and see what pops up. Okay, that's box one. Off to a really, really good start on box one. With the, uh, the turtles there and the uh, wolverine. And maybe the sun man and green goblin will pay off too. So let's uh, pack this up and we'll get to box number two. And here's the second box. Got a little heft to it. I see Star Wars. What's on the sheet here? Electronic Furby Babies? Racing Champions. Uh, I don't really need too many of those. Hot Wheels Racing. Oh, Matchbox. Winner's Circle. Alright, must be some die cast in here. Oh, there's another. Battle Droid. Again, not high dollar, but, you know, people like them. It's not a bad little toy. Oh, here's the racing the winner's circle, I guess. There's Matchbox. I'm just going to pull these out. Racing. Oh, I've got a bunch of these in here. There's another one. There's another one. Oh, Alice Cooper. A lot of yellowing on that bubble. There's another Alice Cooper car. I guess they've got some more coming here. 
I got a lot of these uh, Hot Wheels racing ones. That is a low rider. Getting a lot of toning on that bubble. Same one. You can see the difference in the amber toning. That this one's really, really dark. And there we go. More Furbies. Furby babies. I've had a few of these. Uh, they're not the fastest seller, but they do sell. Let's see if we got any. Alright, so we got some different colors. That seems to be. Um, and I'm no expert. It seems to be the difference maker, though. They must collect them by the color. Uh, so some colors are definitely better sellers and worth a little more than the others. And that looks like, yeah, that's a repeat on there. Uh, but that's okay. You know, they sell. Um, not real thrilled with the, the die cast stuff. I mean, they, they move. I take them to shows and just basically blow them out. Um, buck to uh, maybe three four dollars a piece depending on what they are um, so I don't really mess with those online or anything they're just usually not worth it uh, let me get this one packed back up I think the Furbies are probably the big winner there just because I've got so many of them and uh, we'll get on to box number three here and here's box number three so on the side it says Street Fighters uh, NWO Wrestling 1999 and Rock'em Sock'em 2001. So, we'll see if that's what's actually in there. I would assume if it's not in here, most of that stuff is in another box. But I have not had a lot of luck with uh, what's on the box being in here. And of course I say that, and there it is. There's a Sock'em robot right there. And I think it's a 99 in the box. Let's see what this says on the back. Oh, it must be on the bottom. There we go. On that, and it looks like 2001 on that one. Oh, that's kind of cute. Chun-Li, Street Fighter Jr. I don't remember seeing the Jr. figures. And uh, Ken. What year are these little gems? I suppose they're about the same. Early 2000s. That looks like 99 there. Oh, they've got different years. Well, it looks like it's 99 for all of them. Okay. And another Chun-Li. So that's interesting. And here's the, uh, here's the wrestling. So, I don't know. Let's see what we've got in here. Uh, Sting. Okay. Another Sting. A little bit of amber toning on that one. Uh, another Sting who was evidently clearanced several times. Finally sold for $1.47 as the last price on there. That That's pretty good. I'm guessing this is the same... Whoop. Yep, same action figure. Um, don't recognize them at all. Don't know anything about the uh, NW... Uh, Oh, figures, but I guess we'll go find out. So uh, that's it. The first box is probably, whoops, the most interesting with the the turtles and the Marvel and the Wolvie. And this box is kind of cute. The Furbies, so not too bad overall for a three box set. These could be interesting too. Um, so I'll find out there. And I guess that's it for now. Check out our other unboxing videos. We got a sticker removal video. Um, some office renovation stuff, all sorts of fun stuff on there. So click like, hit subscribe, and thanks for watching.